Some of the most well-known songs in the world come from Africa. They have elements of both traditional African rhythms and Western pop music styles. They instantly lift our spirit and make us want to dance all night long. Whenever we hear them, we automatically think of Africa. Let's take a look at the list of the top 10 best African songs of all time. 1. African Queen by Two-Face Edibia Nigerian. Two-Face Edibia is one of the greatest hip-hop singers of all time. His lovely vocals are included in the song African Queen, which harness African ladies. The song, which was published in 2004, has become a huge hit all over the continent. Although some claim that the song is about how males treat African women, it is actually demonstrates how admirable African ladies are. They don't need guys to be arrogant or feel superior to other women. 2. Noma Kanjani by Brenda Fassi, South African. Brenda Fassi was one of the best known vocalists from Africa. She is best known for the song Noman Kanjani. The song describes her experience of falling in love with a man. It became one of her signature songs throughout her nearly three decade career. It was written by Brenda Ingriza, who died in 2004 from an asthma attack at the age of 37. 3. Malaika by Fadi Williams, Kenyan. One of the greatest songs ever recorded by a Kenyan musician is this song, Malaika, written by the late Fadhili Williams, first appeared in 1963. Kenya's Malaika is considered one of the finest African songs ever written. The song was quite well liked throughout Africa, not just in Kenya. It became immensely popular in the US due to its African American audience who fell in love with the song's groove and melody. 4. Once a Slave by Project Mons featuring Malana, Ghanaian. The Ghanaian reggae band Project Mons song Once a Slave, popularly known as Black Man's Inferiority Complex, is one of their best songs. The song, made in conjunction with the Maulana, which was published in 2006, has subsequently grown in popularity. The song, Once a Slave, sets the tone for an inspiring message that aims to encourage black men to embrace their culture. Meziz Ali by Asta Ariki, Ethiopian. Ethiopians produce some of the best songs ever to be recorded in Africa. Asta Awike is one of the most outstanding female singers from Ethiopia. Throughout her career, she has received several nominations for honors and prizes. Her songs are regarded as being uplifting, romantic, and inspirational. The song's message is rather straightforward, but it has gained a lot of popularity because it looks out look on life. Zamenamena Zangelewa by Golden Sounds Cameroonian. Zamenamena is one of the first Cameroonian songs to be known outside of Cameroon. The song has African instrumentation that uses drums, bells, whistles, and other African instruments. It offers a distinctive claims into the traditional African sub Sahara worldview. 7. Premier Gao by Magic System Ivorian. The groovy rhythm of Premier Gao distinguishes it from other songs released in the same year or even earlier. The English translation of Premier Gao's chorus is first dance, therefore it clears why this was picked as the song's title. The song describes the qualities of a lady who is genuinely admired and loved by a man. Mumbo Lumbo by Angelique Kijo, Benin. Angelique Kijo's Mumbo Lumbo is one of the rare African songs that truly captures the essence and aesthetic of African music and culture. It was written to introduce Africa as we do not typically see it. The song is about African strength and overcoming any challenges life may throw your way. Hi, I'm by Yvonne Chakachaka, South African. Yvonne Chakachaka is regarded as one of South Africa's most adored musicians. Her song, Ankambothi, that is African beer, is one of her most well-known. It was one of the first African records to be released in South Africa following the end of apartheid. In 2007, South Africa was commemorating 20 years of democracy and this song was performed in the U.S. Kubi Bamba 
by Avilo Longoba, Congolese. Avilo Longoba is undoubtedly the most well-known musician in Congo. He rose to the top of the African music scene after releasing the song Kubimbamba in 1998. His music has distinctive beats and rhythm that stick with you long after the song is over. Some people refer to him as the king of Lingala music. Thank you for watching. Please do like, subscribe and share your comments.